Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all enjoying your day. I have a new video for you. I have recently ordered a few pieces from H&M's collaboration with Jim Batista Valley. They released their collection, I think, on Thursday morning. So I got up early and literally was just clicking on the website and I managed to get some pieces in my size. They did all sell out pretty quickly, like the big dresses. Um, but I'm going to unbox these now because I've literally just come through the door. Give you guys my real opinion on each piece and tell you how they fit. So sit back and I hope you guys enjoy. So when I got on the website, the pieces I saw were um, very floral, the dresses, they had short dresses, like mini star dresses and long ball gown dresses. I did want the red um, tall dress that I think Kendall Jenner wore at the show. Everyone wants that dress. It's like short at the front and long at the back. It has a really big train at the back. Really nice, big and fluffy and a real plunging front. Um, but I wasn't able to get that dress and then I wanted the pink dress that strapless it's tall again and very like cinched at the waist short and very full like almost like a tutu skirt but that was also sold out unfortunately in my size so the piece I'm going to show you now they're very different they're not tall they're actually all printed pieces but well, apart from one which is beaded okay so it comes in this the name, the front, which is kind of cute. A box within a box. This is the first dress. Um, and it's a strapless uh, mini dress with a full skirt. Come closely because of the real detail. It's very intricate beading. I'll try the dress on so you guys can see how it fits. Um, but first impressions, very like fairy tale and fluffy and very prom style. Trying this on, I felt very princess-like, um, very nice cinched at the top and it has like the bustier effect at the chest which is nice and then the skirt is really puffy. The design is so intricate it's it's just amazing to look at like the detail. This is another mini style dress and um, on the website it was shown to be stand back so you guys can see like a one shoulder style um, like this but I see that like I think it could be worn just like this as well, just off both shoulders. A very busy, busy floral print. It's actually that like the sound of lots of little pleats. That's the canvas picking that up. And lots of underlayers, which adds to that like flared, full flared effect. Trying this dress on, I felt very much um, very feminine. I think this has more versatility, just puts a little less high maintenance but again gorgeous and very very easy to wear very flattering and easy flowing on the figure as well the final dress out of the collection that i have here for you today is this long length gorgeous like ruffle tiered gown um i think this might be my favorite and i haven't even tried it on yet i just it's definitely more my style the color palette um, a bit more like darker flex like darker tones ingrained as i thought trying this gown on so flowing like cascading off my figure and so flattering very easy to wear no restrictions i think no matter what size you are this dress i'm um, definitely designed for all body types i just love the ruffles the ruffles are beautiful add so much movement to the dress so that is all the dresses um that i ordered um, with H&M and their collaboration with Jim Batista Bali. Um, I like all of them. I actually think um, I'm super impressed by the beading of the first dress. Uh, I do realize how intricately designed it would be. Um, but I think my favorite might be the last one. It's just closer to my personal style than if I was to choose like a long neck dress. Um, and I could see myself keeping this in my wardrobe for a very, very long time. Um, so out of three, that would be my favourite. Um, so yeah, I don't know if I'm going to keep all three. Let me know what you think in the comments below, which ones I should keep. Um, if you like any of these designs, it would be really interesting to see your thoughts. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next time.